when it is time now to start creating the things in positron and displaying the output as a table output let us start from a blank slate and let us now create a new project this time we are creating our project and i am creating this file name using table output so we have the ui but we will create some table and we will display the output in the table we will open it in current window and uh, here is the coding window so the code that we will type in here is this one uh, this is a very simple code uh, the ui part uh, the user interface part displays this table output which is default table output and the data values are coming from here right so there is a data frame used here and this is according to library shiny in positron ide and uh, the output dollar default table render table has this uh, data frame which has these values uh, attributes i should say investment type return rate risk level and these are the attributes and the values of these attributes are for investment type these are stocks bonds and real estate for rate of return this is seven three and five percent and risk level it is high low and medium so when we run this first of all it would ask us to save it we will save it as app.r and once we save it we can now run it and we can view it in the default browser window and we see this uh, comes like this right investment type stock bonds real estate this is uh, attribute and uh, the second attribute is return rate 735 and third attribute is risk level high low medium right so these three are called attributes and these values in rows are called rows or tuples right so sometime it is a good idea to display your outputs as a, as a table output right so this is what we learned that yes in positron using uh, shiny library we can create it with these uh, seven lines of code in next learning we will talk about how to get some inputs from user and then display it in a table right so thanks for joining today and i will see you next time